Not long ago, aesthetic dentistry was considered a very exclusive branch of dentistry, limited to only film stars and the like. But the times have changed. Today, patients want to have restorations, which not only last long, but also look natural. With the rapid advances in materials and equipments of dentistry, it is possible to have aesthetic restorations which mimic the tooth. This requires learning newer concepts, techniques, practicing them during and on session, and finally applying them in our clinics, so as to provide the best quality of dental treatment to our patients. Complete aesthetic program covering four topics over 10 days includes lectures, hands-on and interactive discussions, relevant scientific knowledge with step-by-step -step procedures. As a faculty, I'll be discussing with you my clinical experiences collected over 32 years of practice. Over the next few weeks, I'll be discussing certain topics with you and will be giving you a glimpse of what you could learn in each of these four courses. So, let's get started. So today we are going to discuss how to take care of sensitivity while you are doing bonding. As you can see that cavity is already prepared on this tooth and we will be first making sure that there are no debris on this present tooth. So first we are going to wash the tooth with water and then dry. After which, we are going to apply 30 to 40% phosphoric acid gel on the cut portion that is primarily enamel, the cavity preparation. Now we are going to just agitate this gel. This step should be over within the span of 15 seconds. Of high wax suction, remove the gel. Wash the teeth thoroughly. Remove the excess water. But make sure the tooth enamel, the dentine is not totally dry. This is called selective etching technique or partial etch technique which is popularly known. Now apply the universal bonding system all over the tooth. Scrub on the dentine as per the manufacturer's instruction, which is 20 second in this case. Now apply on the enamel. Remove the excess solvent by blowing air. And to make thin film of bonding agent, light cure it with a good LED for 10 seconds.
you will be able to see a shining smooth surface which indicates that the bonding agent has flown into all over the cavity uniformly and now you are ready to proceed with composite layering. So as you can see this is one of the way to take care of sensitivity by bonding. Now the question arises, what is self-edge bonding system? How and where to use them? What's the difference between total edge and self-edge techniques? Get answers to all these questions and many more in our Aesthetic Direct Restoration Workshop. See you soon.